Welcome, I'm Ken York with Seminole County's Economic Development. I'm so pleased to be here today to introduce our business spotlight series featuring Invacare Corporation. I'm joined by their Director of Operations, Chris Carter. Chris, please tell us about Invacare. So Invacare is a global company with about 6,000 associates worldwide in about 80 countries. This facility here in Sanford, Florida is a manufacturing site where we make uh, home hospital beds, respiratory products, and nursing home furniture. We have about 350 associates. We work over two shifts and we've been here for about 30 years in Seminole County. Not a lot of people know about us. We're at the end of Lake Mary Boulevard, right across from the airport, but if you ever make your way down here, we'd love to host any visitors who may want to come through. The products we, do, we manufacture here are distributed throughout North America through five distribution centers located in Atlanta, New Jersey, Texas, California, and Ohio. We also manufacture and distribute to European countries as well as South America, all from this facility. Chris, what do you see for Invacare in the next three to five years? Well, for us as a manufacturing site, we're all about jobs and keeping the stability right here in Central Florida for the for local economy. So our desire is always to bring more additional product in for manufacturing here in Sanford, keeping the 350 associates we have working all the time. And the goal eventually would be obviously having a 24 seven operation working around the clock with as many associates as we can get. Joining me now is Garrett Smiley, Production Manager for Invacare. Garrett, please tell us about the day-to-day -day operations of Invacare in Sanford, Florida. Well, we have a 110,000 square foot facility here which we manufacture a wide range of products under. Right behind me, you'll see our respiratory facility where we manufacture oxygen concentrators which help our customers breathe 100% pure, pure oxygen at their homes. And we also manufacture a home fill unit that allows our customers to take that oxygen and fill their oxygen cylinders in the comfort of their own home. We currently produce a little over a thousand units per day and we put one in the box approximately every 56 seconds. On the east side of our plant, we manufacture our steel frame beds. We make a, both a home care and a long-term care bed. We consume over 30 tons of steel per day uh, through our punching, pressing, welding, and powder coating processes. And we also assemble over 500 beds a day, putting one in the box approximately every 60 seconds. And then we also manufacture furniture in our cases department. We cut, sand, stain, and assemble all of our own cabinets that have been customized by the customer themselves. So we have a lot of operations under one roof, as you can see, which literally means that we have something for everyone. The 300 people out on the shop floor, they're the ones that are making the product, doing the day-to-day -day work. And we also have 50 engineers, accountants, and other support staff that supports these people out here and allows them to do their job the correct way every day. Garrett, why is Seminole County a great home for Invacare and your 350 associates? Seminole is a great home because it's very easy to attract good employees here. We have an amazing climate, we have an amazing school district, and we have amazing communities around here that allow people to come in and want to work here. On behalf of Seminole County, I would like to thank Invacare Corps and especially Chris Carter and Garrett Smiley for allowing us to peek inside your business. For more information on the company, please visit www.invacare.com or for more information on economic development, please visit businessinseminal.com. This is Business Spotlight. I'm Ken York.